Hashem, uh, it's me Pierre, welcome to the new video. Give me a hand. We are all free today. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we are all free today, we went to the canting. Ah, it's so exciting to use this road and it always a little bit for me like when we when we have an idea to go here. I was always thinking how it's gonna be the road because to those who know how the Genting road looks like it sometimes it's not easy to get in especially when there is a lot of tracks a lot of lots of lorries so but here we are we're gonna go for some food and then we're gonna see actually what we can do here because we we just have no any plan what we're gonna do here in Genting so today. actually if I'm not mistaken like a year ago we was in the same place but we was here with my parents it was a year ago Two years ago, a year ago. A year, a year yeah, a year ago we was in the same place. We was coming here to visit. Today we are again. Um, but like I said, we gotta go first to eat some food because we are hungry and, and maybe it's gonna be better. And later I'm gonna show you all this place that is around me. So uh, yeah, let's go for some food. Already can see that something changing the, in the Genting because last time they didn't have this Swenson. So this is something new, so probably Again, after one year coming here, uh, probably we will see some different maybe shops, maybe different restaurants. The same, yeah, the same. I don't know what is this Bruce Lee, but he wasn't here, but maybe because of a, yeah, so anyway. Yeah, of Dragon so uh, Yeah, yeah maybe that's why, yeah. Like exhibition, like bio. Oh, there's a cinema. Yeah, there's a cinema. Oh. I don't know, sometimes I don't remember some of the shops maybe, but definitely this one, the Swenson that I showed you just now is uh, it's just different. It's just like a, something new that we didn't uh, see before. Like my wife said, this restaurant, which is the burger and lobster, as you can see. The last time when we come here, the queue was, I think, from here to the end. Now, no one, even out, even inside is uh, quite empty, so it's uh, like a strange feeling. <laughs> Yeah, but maybe because of the prices, because if you will see like 130, 98, 88, lobster, 200 ringgit, so maybe, yeah, maybe, uh, yeah, the, the, the food here not cheap though. Like from that, what I can notice, there is like a plenty of like a small styles now. Uh, I don't remember those things that are behind me. So good, good for change, it means that maybe, uh, maybe the business is, is a little bit better. Uh, so, uh, yeah. And uh, one thing that I need to do in my life when I'm here in Malaysia, I need to go for that uh, theme park and try the rides. But the problem is that uh, <laughs> I never know what will be the weather when we come in here. You know, all the way when we was like uh, climbing up through the through the through the mountain, sun. Really, first time in my life when I come here, there is a sun all the way up. Basically, only when we start to reach in the hotels there start to be like a fog and start to be cold but usually not, it was like a sun all the way I was like a little bit like a maybe not shocked but I do it's such a nice feeling like I go outside and then it's like uh, it's uh, it's not so warm I feel like we are in the room where is the air comes so it's it's nice feeling nice change especially that now why in Malaysia is quite quite warm nearly every day it's like a 36 degrees 34 so now it's like a nice like a change nice like a different kind of a uh, feeling when you can just walk and you feel really like uh, like everywhere is an uh, aircon on and it's quite nice, quite chill, nice. Okay, that's scenery. Outside. Coconut soup. This is crazy. I never eat the uh, steam bottle of the coconut. This is a uh, bone soup. soup with the collagen. Yeah. Food that we gonna eat. It's quite interesting. I, I wonder how this one gonna taste. This is the first time actually that I'm gonna finally is a clear view can see and everything. Love. I need to go there one day for these rides and everything. But maybe I'm just way too old for that. Anyway, can try one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not bad, not bad. Of course, cannot forget about the view for a hotel, colorful hotel. Probably you see that many, many times, but maybe there is some of the people who are here first time, so on this channel, so I, uh, <laughs> they shouting. From which one? Oh, over there. See the one shouting. Crazy. I want to try this one over there. 
Anyway, one day we will come here when he will be older. Then we can all come together here and then we can you try these rides. And if you, anyway, anyway, if you've been here, you can let me know in the comments is it worth to come and, and how is it? Uh, because if he's gonna be older, old enough to come here, probably I'm gonna be 50 years old, so it's gonna be interesting. Well, I don't know that I mentioned, but uh, maybe I forget. But the the, the uh, steam boat that we went, actually the food quite nice and everything okay, but uh, like for me it's like overpriced. Um, and yeah, and and it's just a little bit too much like for me. And I know that maybe it's called like how we call it like a posh. Porsche steamboat and everything that people help you but to be honest with you it was a little bit too much when like a few people around me just just help us to do everything I'm very used to, to do myself and they usually the place where we go in for a hot pot like Sukiya or uh, there is one more that sometimes we go in uh, I'd rather to do my myself everything so I and I think it's more worth the price I mean of course it is a game thing so you need to pay more but uh, but still, a little bit overpriced. Anyway, Nicolas way. We will see what's, what will happen next. And uh, since we are on the like a top floor and you saw the cable cars, uh, sometimes uh, people are asking, is it worth to take the cable cars? I think it's, uh, I think it's worth to do it. Like, uh, you know, even the, the price is not very low, but I still, I think if you are here in the Gantic and if you are here as a tourist, so I really recommend to take the cable car go down. You don't need to necessarily uh, go to the shopping mall that is like a little bit lower. But since uh, like if you are in the Genting, you should take the cable cars. I even strongly recommend you to pay for uh, uh, the cable cars with a glass floor. Go to the priority uh, queue. It's it's of course you will have to pay more, but I still it's worth to do it when you are here in the Genting and see how is it looks like the, 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 the whole hill and everything what you can see here so I think if you if, if yeah I think this is the best answer what I can give you but of course everything is depend from the weather because there is I remember when last time I was here with my parents a year ago we can't really see anything till we just really go down down of the hill then then only can see some views and everything so everything is depend from the weather There is some changes. I think I didn't see that before. That like a gopa. Quite nice, quite nice, quite impressive. Last time here was a little bit lesser, lesser like attraction, but now it's like a more and more. Oh. Dinosaur! Wow! <laughs> so usually when you are in uh, when you are in the Genting, you need to come here to have a look on this beautiful ride that is inside the shopping mall. Yeah, inside ski uh, <laughs> inside theme park. Most of the people that come in here, there is always like uh, the uh, what's it called? The start of a video. All the YouTubers who's coming here doing exactly the same, which is choosing the place somewhere here, doing the thumbnail. That's why it's so very popular to come here downstairs. And this is on the first floor, by the way. So have a look on the how those rides like this one over there and this. This is just crazy. What? <laughs> yeah, so all of them for us. Crazy thing. This time when we are in the Genting, definitely, definitely there is lesser and lesser people. But yeah, today is Wednesday, so I'm not surprised. Anyway, Genting Skyward. If anyone interested, today is really nice weather. You can see the cable cars and everything. So not bad, not bad. So it's like quite chilly. Now it's like a 10 to 6. Uh, probably we're gonna stay a little bit longer uh, then we're gonna go for some food and then I'm gonna embrace myself in the pay uh, I need to be patient because last few times when we get back from the Genting we stuck to the gone back tall and I had to wait very 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 long time in the queue so we will see how it's gonna be this time for the dinner we will have something from the Zook noodle house as you can see uh, we are first time here so let me have a look what they have um, Probably we're gonna get some. Oh, this is like a dim sum again. Um, 
dry noodles. Okay, let me choose something that I will tell you what I what I get. I'm gonna go with a classic noodles. That's gonna be interesting because yeah, the noodles quite famous. So let's see how it's gonna look like. Change my mind. Look at that. Very nice. Quite interesting to eat the with a lemon. Grass. That will be that's it in this video. We're gonna get back home. Uh, looks like not bad on the road according to google Maps. so what can i say thank you for watching i hope you enjoy leave the like leave the subscription if you're new on the channel and uh, uh see you in the next video bye bye